in London, but it's just temporary. So I'm here today to go on a tour of London on an e-bike, and uh, it's all about the new Shimano Steps E6100 uh, gear that's being released this autumn. And so I'm going to continue my journey on learning about e-bikes. And I thought I would take you along. So let's uh, go check out London on an e-bike. My ride, uh, it's got DI2 um, okay, automatic shifting. Very exciting. So this is my cockpit. Yeah, try turbo. First thoughts of e-bikes, Tess? I think they're great. Do they make you smile? I love the fact that you can, it walks up hills for you. That's, <laughs> That's a good feature. See, it's a tiny bit too big for me still because I'm like this big, but it's okay. <laughs> This is what we were here to see. It is the new E6100 series. So it is all the components that make up the system for the e-bike, including on my bike, this Nexus Inter 5E hub system. So um, that's where the gearing is. It's all internal, which is great for uh, keeping it clean and uh, smooth running. And then of course the battery, what you need for an e-bike. And then for controlling the bike, it had buttons on the left here, and that controls up and down your speed, so um, eco and normal and high. And there's a walking uh, mode as well for going uphill with the bike. And then you can also, with the middle button, change your screen display so you can see all your stats and everything. And then on the right hand side, those buttons are to change your gears. It's DI2 shifting. Um, this bike actually had automatic shifting, but you can override that shifting using uh, the buttons on the right. So very easy setup, nothing complicated. I think they're really fun. They take absolutely no effort to ride. So it's just really fun to cruise around the city on them. I was surprised at how easy it is to handle. I expected for such a heavy bike it would be a lot more like cumbersome to manoeuvre but it was actually pretty easy. Okay, I've never ridden in London so it was quite an experience. It's really good, um, really easy to handle and love the way it kicks off when you, when you sort of first start. In high power. Yeah, yeah. Well and the eco as well and normal. Yeah. So yeah, really good. How much I liked it actually. Yeah. I thought I wouldn't like it. I thought it'd be... Um, 
bit of an e-bike snob, but I'm not, so it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's great for access for people less able um, and also commuters. If you've got like a long commute and you don't want to get all sweaty, or even a short commute and it's a hot day and you've got to wear a suit or whatever, it's perfect for that sort of thing. So. Perfect. Yeah. So there is a place in the world for e-bikes. There's a place. <laughs> I'm going to have a go on e-mountain bikes. Oh, yes. That was my day with Shimano. They treated us well, they fed us well, and it was good company. Um, and good on you, Shimano, for bringing out the women. Good turnout for the women. And it was great to see Tess again, who I met in Manchester at the British Cycling event. So uh, a great event, great bikes, great fun. Uh, I enjoyed the DI2 automatic shifting. I didn't think about shifting our gears all day, so I just could enjoy the ride, and it was great to have a guide taking us through all the back roads of London. All in all, a fantastic day. I hope you enjoyed coming along and uh, any questions or anything let me know in the comments below and uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next video.